Hello everyone, and welcome back for another Skyrim. Uh, last we left off, we were going to look for the drunk man and the staff. And we found like a necromancer area. It would almost appear as if they were using the staff for some kind of evil magic. And there was a portal that led us here. This is called Misty Grove. I don't really know... Are these bad guys? Good guys? Whoa. They see me, so it must be okay. Hello. Hey! You're here. I was beginning to think you might not make it. I have all the things needed to repair it. Oh, the Hagraven feather and so on. You can throw all those out. You see... Uh-huh. I really just needed something to encourage you to go out into the world and spread merriment. What? And you did just that. I haven't been so entertained in at least a hundred years. What the heck are you? Who are you? I am Sanguine, Daedric Prince of Debauchery. Why did you choose me? Let's be honest here. I don't always think my decisions through. <laughs> you, you're going for yeah. Maybe a little influence from your old Uncle Sanguine could help adjust your course a bit. Thanks, I guess. Um, okay, where am I? Whoa! Am I back in solitude? Heard any rumors lately? People say there's a man wandering the streets near the Blue Palace. He seems distressed, but he's not making any sense. Ah. Okay. Okay. Last episode, we had a guy, we need to level up, but also we had a guy that brought stuff to us, and I don't know what he gave us. Here it is, a letter of inheritance. It is with great regret that we inform you of Carlotta Valentina's death. Yeah, I saw her, she was dead in the street. So that's kind of weird. Carlotta chose us to give her inheritance to. We only helped her that one time. Remember when we stopped that guy from harassing her? That's kind of weird. Well, thanks, I guess. I guess if you do quests for people and then they die, you get their money. Because I wasn't married to her or anything. Dun 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 dun. Oh, I hear him. Hello, crazy. Let's be friends. Boop. Please. Yeah, tell me what you want. Oh. I didn't mean to give you gold. What My do you want? Has abandoned me. Abandoned his people. And nothing I say can change his mind. The master? Now he refuses to even see me. He says I interrupt his vacation. <laughs> it's been so many years. Won't you please help? How can I find your master? Last I saw him, he was visiting a friend in the Blue Palace. But no one as mundane as a Jarl. No, no. Such people are below him. No, he went into the forbidden wing of the palace to speak with an old friend. Said it had been ages since they had last had tea. Huh. Oh, and you'll need the hip bone. It's very important. No entering Pelagius's wing without that. The hip bone? What? You. May the gods watch over your battles, friend. I need in. To this place. Absolutely not. That wing has been sealed for hundreds of years. It'll make an exception for you. But do not bring anything out when you leave. Too many dark deeds transpired in those halls. Come on, man. You know me. I would totally not bring any like stuff yours. back. Well, <laughs> I would totally not loot the place and take all the things. I would not do that to you. I am very trustworthy. Yeah. There's a lot of stuff here. A lot of junk laying around. What was that? Oh, I think that was me. Oh! Oh, the little goat. I'm sorry, little guy. Ooh. What just happened? The 
Um. Hello? My husband hasn't slept in three days. Did he just say his husband hasn't slept in three days? What? I'm sorry. Oh. Oops. He has to go back to his husband. It'll be fine. Really? Oh, oh, what kind of message? A song. A summons. Wait, uh, I know. A death threat written on the back of an Argonian concubine. Ah! Oh, my. Quit talking. Let me tell you stuff. There's a crazy man in town that wants to talk to you, okay? By who? Wait! Don't tell me. I want to guess. Oh, God. I find a lot of Daedric princes around here lately. Now that's the real question, isn't it? Because honestly, how much time off could a demented Daedra really need? Welcome to the deceptively verdant mind of the Emperor Pelagius III. That's right! You're in the head of a dead, homicidally insane monarch! <laughs> now, cool. I so it looks like I don't have any followers with me. Unless they're going to show up later. I don't know. Oh my god. I can't change my... I can't go into my inventory. What am I wearing? Oh! Lydia appeared. What have they done to me? Hold on. Oh god. Good god. This looks terrifying. I'm right behind you. I'm glad cuz look at me. Look what they've done to me. Get out of the chair. We're not having tea time with the mad hatter over here. We're going. Pelagius hated and feared many things. Assassins, uh -huh. wild dogs, the undead. Pumpernickel. Pumpernickel. But the deepest, keenest hatred was for himself. All right, let's kill him. If he hates himself so much. Oh my god, is that a tiny the man? The he makes on himself can be seen here fully. They're always carried out on the weakest part of his fragile self. What the heck? The self-loathing enhances Pelagius' anger. Ah, but his confidence will shrink with every hit. You must bring the two into balance. D okay, so... Don't my hands look like pimp hands? Like, it looks like I'm wearing some kind of pimp outfit with cheetah print, and I've got some bling on my fingers. What if I... Hey! Anger! Die! Someone there? Die! Eh! Self-doubt is not going down. Can anger go down? Eh. No. What if I whop confidence? Oops. Okay. Die. And you too. Whop. Yes. Get bigger. Pelagius is finally ready to love himself. Aww. Continue hating everyone else. Oh. Well, that's a shame. <laughs> okay. On to the next one. Here. Oh, good choice. Uh huh. Well, good for me. I find everyone being out to get you so terribly entertaining. <laughs> mm. You might find it less so. You see, Pelagius's mother was, well, let us say, unique. Although I suppose, in the grand scheme of things, she was fairly average for a septum. Okay. There's something going on up here. Oh, dang. Here is simple, you simple thing. Whoa! Use your wabaja to defeat the enemy. While they do the same. Wop, wop, wop. Hold still. I'm trying to jabble walk you. This fight seems to be going nowhere. Can I just kill one of them? Oh! I thought you'd never oh! 
<gasps> With the threat gone, Pelagius what the heck? Delusion that he's safe, which means you oh. helped him out, sort of. And we're that much closer to home. Oh, okay. Yay! We did it! You've headed down the path of dreams. Ooh. Unfortunately for you, Pelagius suffered night terrors from a young age. Oh, of course. He couldn't just have, uh, normal dreams. He's terrified. Wake up! Eh. Wakey, wakey, eggs and bakey. Eh. Uh oh. Go, go, go. That goat's gonna fight him. Oh no, don't kill the goat. Hey. Eh. Die. Aw. We turned him into a little boy. Hi there. Hi. So we're basically turning his nightmares into something that's good. He likes goats. This is him as a little kid being happy. Oh my god. No! Okay, he likes prostitutes. Of course. Yeah! A sultry maiden. <laughs> wow. What is that thing? Oh. Well, now that's something to crow about. With Pelagius up and about, he likes treasure. Right along. We'll both be home in no time. Mm-hmm. Let's make sure I'm not forgetting anything. Clothes, check. Yeah. Weird. Check. Luggage. Luggage. I don't know. Oh! Master, you've taken me back. Does this mean we're going home? Oh, happy Ooh. times. I, I can't wait to. Fish stick. Yes, yes, that's quite enough celebration. Let's <laughs> go As for okay. you, a little mortal minion, feel free to keep the Waba Jack. As a symbol of my. I'll just take it out. All right. Um. Whoa! Oh, he's gonna teleport us. I actually really liked that guy. He was really fun. Why can't I move? Uh-oh. Oh wow, my weight is up really high. He took off my backpack, that's why. Okay, I think we've got everything back on. And I threw out a bunch of junk that I didn't need. <laughs> Stuff I picked up. Um, do do do. Seems like he doesn't want to talk to me. Huh. I guess we finished the quest. Alrighty guys, that's going to be it for today's video. I hope you enjoyed. Um, next time, I am either going to go towards the Bard's College, because I heard they're looking for new recruits, or I'm going to go back to Whiterun and find out why people are just murdering each other in the streets randomly. <laughs> Alrighty guys, I'll see you for the next one. Bye!